Hi everybody, I'm Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot on YouTube and Buddy Advice on Facebook. You can find my links to all other channels just there. And you can become a free member, a free of charge, just down there. Just hit the membership button and hit the bell if you would like to be notified. I go live once a week, either on Friday or Saturday on Facebook. And sometimes I go live with uh, Brenda Cannon. She's also a reader on YouTube. And you can find her link also here, uh, as I recommend her. And uh, Gregory Scott, he's an astrologer and he's fantastic. Um, so if you want to get notified and if you want to have a, a free card uh, when we go live, then just become a member and get notified, as I will notify you uh, through um, a notification on YouTube and Facebook. On the 31st, we have the first card, and that's the Two of Fire. And the Two of Fire means you can see two people standing there, looking out in front of them into the distance. And I use, sometimes I do mix up two and three of staves, because that's the fire energy, because then I think, ah, oh, well, the boats are coming in, but you're planning, you're at the planning stages now, uh, perhaps a new partnerships, perhaps a new relationship. Um, you're getting into action. You couldn't continue to move forward. And that's the traditional one. He's got the world in his hand. So don't give up because you can get what you want. The world is bigger than you think. The world is your oyster, as they say in England. And actually in stage three, and that's where I, um, I go it wrong, your boats, you see the little dots here? Those are boats, they are coming in. They are coming home to the safe haven or harbour. So you're at the planning stage and you're nearly there to actually see it coming in. It, you can see it this way, the end of the year, so you can close things off and there's a new beginning, a new year. So, um, your boats will be coming in in the new year. Remember, it is a year three, so what you have sown this year, you will reap next year. Um, then on the 31st, we have the Knight of Earth, and uh, the, he is um, actually a good card to have for the finish of the year going into the new year. He's the most steady knight that brings news of something, perhaps a new job, a new project, perhaps uh, a steady relationship, but he's the most steadiest and for long, for the long duration he goes for what he wants and for long term. So perhaps that is what you're planning, you're seeking something, a relationship, a job or whatever, security for long term. And then on the 1st of January, we start with um, the Two of um, Air, the Two of Swords. Perhaps you have to make a decision. Perhaps you're getting more choices than one. Um, and we've got a two here as well. So perhaps you have to make a decision on something um, and you don't like. You can see here these two guys are looking into the future. Um, and perhaps they're dreaming and they don't know which decision they will make. But it will be a good partnership because two twos is a four. So something for long term with balance um, will be coming in the new year, like I said. This is going to be the year to receive your abundance for long term and um, for a long duration. It is a good reading, I think. It's brilliant, actually. It's good news for me, anyway. And for the theme card, we have self-acceptance. So accept yourself, who you are and what you are, and um, try to love yourself a little bit more in the new year if you don't do that already. You don't have to be the bank manager or the queen or the king because... You're just as good as a knight. A knight also fights for his country and also um, works hard. 
just like the king and the queen. You'll become the king and the queen only if you um, go steady like this knight is actually brilliant. Take action, be passionate and be creative because that is what the ones are. And be willing to learn because you've got the swords here and the swords stand for communication, wisdom. And you can only get wisdom by learning. So I hope you go into the new year in peace, in balance, creativity, passion and duration. Take care and see you tomorrow. Enjoy New Year's Day and I wish you all the best. Thank you for being here and see you in the new year. Ciao, ciao.